So you can see, if we double integrate this equation here, we get a simpler, less complicated version of the Run Einstein. In there! I am tired of your confusing equation. I don't understand what you're talking about, and I don't know what an integer is. I challenge you to lightsaber duel! Why are you not quivering with fear? Because you just have a toy in your hands. No, it is a lightsaber. Listen. <laughs> Lightsabers cannot exist. I have one right here. Listen to it. It makes noise and everything. That's all it does. Lightsabers can't exist? That's disappointing. Yes, the lightsaber. What a wonderful device. Kids everywhere, and even some adults, uh, find the idea of a lightsaber pretty interesting. Here's a small handheld device, but remember, here at the H.R. McMillan Space Center, is going to dash all of our hopes and dreams. Because you're going to tell me that technically a lightsaber really can't exist. No, it can't. W why, why not? Well, first of all, let's see why, how it would work. Okay, so how, does a, how do they say a lightsaber works? Well, there's two possibilities. One is to use a concentrated form of light, okay. as the name suggests, right. or you could use some sort of hot plasma. The problem with light is uh, it would have to be in the form of a laser. Okay. And lasers, you cannot stop them, but three feet from where they begin. Right, so lasers, I mean, like a laser beam just keeps going and going and exactly. uh, going. Okay, so and you wouldn't actually be able to physically just have it only be two and a half feet or three no. feet long. The other, the other problems with that is with, uh, if you hit another lightsaber, Right. Now, if you had two laser beams with each other, they pass right through each other. Right, so that you wouldn't actually even get the little noise that happens and no mayhem and no legs being chopped off, So, which is really half the fun of having a lightsaber. Maybe the technology, maybe we just haven't got there yet. Do you think one day we'll be able to develop a, a lightsaber? Probably not. This is one of these laws of physics thing, right, that we can't mess with? Yeah. Ugh, God, I hate that. Well. Maybe that's a good thing, because really, we don't want people having small handheld devices that uh, can cut people in half, right? I mean, it's hard enough to get an airplane these days. Uh, but, but thank you. That kind of explains how this whole thing uh, works, and it's best, I guess, left just for um, playtime. Yeah? Exactly. Uh, well, for The Express, I'm Cam Cronin. I'm Reminder Samra. And here's Happy Laser Fighting from the H.R. McMillan Space Center.